you guys are going to find through the course of the weekend is that we put all of our focus on mechanics and movement, basics first. And we choose movements that have broad impact. I think training in a way, in a sense, it's kind of like a gamble, right? Because what I'm doing as a coach is I'm willing to bet that the movements that I choose are going to have a broad impact on other movements, meaning that the movements I've chosen for any given workout are going to positively affect several other movements, not just the movement that we're doing that day, right? Because I'm willing to bet that if, you know, I get my kids really, really good at the air squat, that they're going to be better at walking lunges, back squats, front squats, overhead squats, cossacks, jumps, one-legged hops, any unilateral leg movement. They're going to be better off that if I give them the foundation. Would you guys agree? Mm -hmm. Now, if I get my kids really, really good at doing just overhead squats, does that necessarily transfer over to the lunge or the air squat? Not, not necessarily, especially if they don't have the foundation, especially if they don't have the mechanics.